I'm part of an expedition into the Deep Roads. Any information you have could save people's lives. I will die a happy man if I never think about the blighted Deep Roads again. You can't imagine what I've come through to get here. I'm not interested in... Although... A favor for a favor. Does that sound like a fair deal? You help me, I'll help you. Let's be more specific. I don't do anything involving children or animals. I have a warden map of the depths in this area. But there's a price. I came to Kirkwall to aid a friend. A mage. A prisoner in the wretched gallows. The Templars learned of my plans to free him. Help me bring him safely past them, and you shall have your maps. I will not make this deal sight unseen. It's all right here. But you don't see one page until Karl is free. As if the Templars need another reason to hunt us. These are my terms. If you want my aid with your expedition, meet me in the Chantry tonight. I have sent word to Karl to be there. Make her willing, we will all leave free men. thugs who target the streets just because it's dark. I saw Carl go inside a few minutes ago. No Templars so far. Are you ready? I didn't see anyone suspicious out here. Let's do this fast. All right. I'll handle the talking. You watch for Templars. When we find Carl, just let me talk to him. Anders, I know you too well. I knew you would never give up. What's wrong? Why are you talking like... I was too rebellious, like you. The Templars knew I had to be... made an example of. No! How else will mages ever master themselves? You'll understand, Anders. As soon as the Templars teach you to control yourself. This is the apostate. No! You will never take another mage as you took him!
I... Anders, what did you do? It's like... You brought a piece of the Fade into this world. I had already forgotten what that feels like. This bastard ratted you out to the Templars. He wasn't himself. Being made tranquil takes away everything human inside you. He wasn't capable of caring for me anymore. He could only follow the rules. You cannot imagine it, Anders. All the color, all the music in the world, gone. I would gladly give up my magic. But this... I'll never be whole again. Please, kill me before I forget again. I don't know how you brought it back, but it's fading. Carl, no. I would rather die than be tranquil. Help him. I got here too late. I'm sorry, Carl. I'm so sorry. Now! It's fading! Why do you look at me like that? Goodbye. <laughs> we should leave before more Templars come. Talk. What happened to you in the Chantry? I... This is hard to explain. When I was in Amaranthine, I met a spirit of justice who was trapped outside the Fade. We became friends, and he recognized the injustice that mages in Thedas face every day. Just say whatever you have to say. To live outside the Fade, he needed a host. I offered to help him. We were going to work together, bring justice to every child ever ripped away from his mother to be sent to the Circle. But... I guess I had too much anger. Once he was inside me, he... changed. So... you have this spirit of justice living in your head? It's not like that. He's gone now. He's part of me. It's not like we can... have a conversation. I feel his thoughts as my own. Not even the greatest scholar could tell you where I end and he begins. I just need your Grey Warden expertise, not a diatribe on your strange personal habits. Here. These are all the documents I have for this area. I can understand if you would rather me not join you personally. I cannot control my need for vengeance. I would ask no one to take on the danger of traveling with me. I will be here in my clinic if you need me.